Big crowd had a big time under the new dome today. It was a thriller, the game that is. But really, the 10,000 new seats and a dome facelift look pretty good too. Rosalinda Perez filed in with the Oiler faithful and had a first-hand look. Busty! The House of Pain is now the House of Game. $40 million worth of renovations means the Astrodome has a new look. Among other things, it's gained 10,000 new seats. You can see the whole field from here. I think, I think they're pretty good seats. It required the fabrication and installation. 24 years ago, when the Astrodome opened its doors, they called it the eighth wonder of the world. It was the first dome stadium ever built. This will be the greatest concert hall in the world. It's the greatest convention hall in the world. It's the greatest exhibition hall in the world. And by all means, it's the greatest sports facility or entertainment facility that anyone has ever conceived. Today, fans are adjusting to the new look and the new seats. I enjoy them. They're good seats. They're brand new. And uh, I don't really miss the old scoreboard. No, not, not here. I get dizzy. I don't like it. It's too high. It's, it's, it is nice. It's a nice view from here. There was a slight snag for Elaine Connolly and her family. They bought tickets for the very last row. But the seats weren't all in yet. We were quite surprised, yes. <laughs> we didn't intend to buy standing and running. The Connollys did get another place to sit. <laughs> Meanwhile, no problems for other fans, and they think the Oilers will do well enough this year to keep the 10,000 new seats filled. Rosalind Fettis, Channel 2 News. They've done a lot of work out there, also added a new digital audio system and finished the second Diamond Vision screen uh, out in the dome.